We're over here at Lakeshore RV Center checking out this 2018 Raptor 425 TS. This fifth wheel toy hauler sleeps up to nine people. It has three slides, a hitch weight of 3,945 pounds, a ship weight of 15,518 pounds, and a GVWR of 19,000 pounds. The length of this toy hauler is 42 feet 6 inches, has a height of 13 feet 6 inches, and a width of 8 feet 4 inches. Also has a fresh water tank of 110 gallons, and a gray and black water tank both of 82 gallons. And as we take a closer look at this front cap here, you'll see this is a nice high gloss front cap with nice accented LED lighting throughout. It's a nice mirrored hitch vision right here, so that way you can see what you're doing as well as some lights to make sure you can see everything. Underneath you have your LP tanks and on the side here you have your battery hookup as well as your water prep and your tanks and we have this large pass through storage which we'll get a better view on the opposite side as we walk over there now. We also have space for a generator in that front as well. Here's your hydraulic system right there and then that massive pass-through storage that I was talking about from the other side. As you can see plenty of room to put in lots of wonderful camping essentials. Then here's the other slide here we have two awnings going on on this guy. We have one right there over that door and one over here as you can see both have nice LED lighting strip underneath as well as you can see right front there some outdoor speakers. That uh, back door does lead into the garage, which we will take a look at in a minute. First, let's take a look inside the unit here. Take a step up and in. And directly you will see, not only is it 90 degrees out, nice and toasty, but we also have this nice mobile, look at this, nice Your controls here are all on this digital uh, LCD screen here, so you can turn on your lights, your slides, your awnings, control all of that. You can do that through here or also with the mobile app. Connects via Bluetooth right into there. You can also control your vent fans and whatnot. But we can go ahead and take a look at our main living area. First off, you'll see this nice L-shaped sofa here leading right to the entertainment center. We have a nice fireplace underneath your very large LED TV sitting right there. We're at the top of your CD, DVD, Bluetooth player right there. Connects all your sounds. So you have speakers not only outside, but you have also some up top here. We'll take a look at one right there. There's one. And down there, you'll see another one. So that way you can have plenty of sound inside and outside. You can see we have plenty of storage options above the TV. Open up these guys. Nice, with uh, nice glass inlays in there. As we work our way to the opposite side, you'll see this nice little couch with a nice little dinette here. Be able to eat food and relax while able to enjoy the entertainment center. And as we work our way into the kitchen area, you can see that you'll see a nice little pantry area right here. We'll open up and some automatic lights turning on right in there. Load up plenty of food and whatnot. You'll see we have this nice solid surface countertops through here with a overhead sprayer with detachable head. Very convenient for cleaning. And then this cutting board goes over top of your nice incredibly large undermount stainless steel basin sink. But be able to capitalize on all your countertop space with that guy on. As we move over, you can see a nice large conventional microwave here. Not that guy right there. Underneath that, some nice tiled backsplash over your three burner stove top oven and range. So cook on those guys, but when you're not cooking, fold this guy back down and more countertop space. Now we can take a look at the oven right there. Take a look in there. And then right next to that, we have some stores that we can go ahead and open up and take a look at and above the microwave as well. 
And then next to it. So plenty of storage throughout. Then underneath here, take a look at a nice little area for a nice waste basket. <coughs> Excuse me. Open this guy up. Nice little spot to put in some silverware. Or you can open up your full extension stain your full extension ball bearing glide drawers. Close that guy back up. Then in the back here, we'll see inside the garage, you have your fold down sofas that you bring those guys down and you have a double bunk because as you can see the top bunk is up there. Fold those down and you have a nice little booth dinette or fold them down completely and you have a sleeping space. You can see plenty of stuff to be able to tie your toys in here so ATVs, motorcycles and whatnot you can tie those down along with this nice rubberized flooring. This ladder right here actually goes into the back of our, if we bring down our garage, we also have this nice little slide. You bring out the garage, you have an outdoor patio with the garage when you're not using it to haul in your your toys and whatnot. That ladder goes on the back, hooks right into it, so that way you can get up and down very easily. We also have a nice TV here in the back, so that way the kiddos, when they're using this as a bunkhouse, can have some entertainment. There's plenty of storage up here as well. Pop those guys in, and you'll see some more of those speakers up top. This garage also has a half bath here. So you can see the mirror above the sink right there, and we have a foot flush toilet and some kind of little storage down there as well. With that, we can work our way to the front of this unit. As we move up front, we'll take a look at the master bathroom here. Go ahead and open this door. And right away, you'll see your foot flush toilet up front. Your large one-piece shower here with a nice little seat right there. And detachable heads, a skylight, as well as your fan. And then... You can see we have nice stainless steel undermount sink here with that solid surface countertop. Go ahead and open up the mirrored medicine cabinet. We can see inside of there. And beneath of that, we have some more storage spaces. We have some more drawers and a drawer right there. And with that, this master bathroom does lead right into the master bedroom, which we can go ahead and take a step inside right now. We have a nice large king-size bed in here with a couple windows on the side. Get some nice air ventilation going through there. Some overhead lights. On the opposite side, you have your TV, so you can have some entertainment in the bedroom. Underneath that, we have some drawers. Nice little spot right in there, and some nice spot up above. <coughs> And inside of here, we have a nice little prep area for washer and dryer. Pop those guys in there, as well as some more storage space for your clothes. And then we have the nice large mirrored closet in here where you can hang your clothes and put those on top. Slide this guy over, and so we have plenty of mirrors, plenty of space to be able to see everything that you need. And we can move back to the front here. So there you go. This has been Lakeshore RV Center checking out a 2018 Raptor 425TS. Come on by, check us out. We can show you units like this and over 500 more that we have on the lot. You can also check us out online at lakeshore-rv.com where you can enjoy our entire inventory at the comfort of your home. You can always call us at 231-760-8805 where we can get you in contact with one of our knowledgeable and expert salespeople. Well, they'll find you the RV perfect for you and your family. Just give us a call. We can't wait to hear from you.